Hannah Stevenson Connolly, written a book called Sex Life. Well, I, um, my book was published a few months ago, and I'm delighted to, uh, to talk about it today. It's, um, it's really our sexual journey from before we're born until the day we die. So it's sex, 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 and more sex, broken down into decades. Mm, okay. <laughs> um, so I've, I've sort of got testimonies from people of all different ages uh, talking about their own sexuality and so it's a mixture of, you know, diff it, it really illustrates that there are just a myriad of erotic styles out there, that there are, there, there's so many ways um, for, for people to um, design their own sexuality that um, even those you know, that some people decide they don't want to be sexual and that, that um, you know, that's a lot of people talking about that. There are some people who would rather be more sexual than they are and um, basically it's, it's, um, it's, it really covers the gamut. It shows that sex is a, you know, a rich tapestry that um, I, I bust a lot of my myths about sex because there are a lot out there. <laughs> You know, the ones that say, you know, you're, you're sort of supposed to be ready and willing whenever. Um, the ones that say you're not supposed to be sexual at 19. Um, the ones that, that say um, children are not sexual beings. Um, so the, we have a lot of incorrect notions about sexuality, so I've, I've, I've talked about this. I believe that the good people of childhood are, um, you know, very broad-minded, and um, <laughs> I'm looking forward to the question and answers at the end. You know, I I have not travelled much in South America, so that's top of my list. I've always been a little bit afraid, um, but I think I've found a way to... I've never been to Machu Picchu, and I really want to go there. I really want to... I would just like to sort of travel... Um, Shanks Pony all around, places like Peru and Uruguay and Brazil and, and just places that um, that I just have a sort of sense of that really... I've been to Argentina, um, that's the only um, area near there that, that, um, that I've really enjoyed, but, but Argentina is, is quite European in some ways, so, and I was studying tango there, of course, so <laughs> I was basically in the studio the whole time. Uh, but no, no that's, that's on my list. Okay.